please get uh, just two dollars worth of lollies? Kids used to come in and uh, I remember one coming in one day and says, oh, lollipop heaven. And I, I always thought, gee, that'd be a good little name for a shop anyway, lollipop heaven. But we still sell loose lollies. I used to own this deli um, two years ago um, and uh, ran it for 21 years, which was a long time for a corner deli. It has a bit of an iconic uh, nature. If you look along the top up here, you'll see a lot of uh, old-fashioned items. Started to put a few things up there and all of a sudden people were going through their shed looking for old things and bringing them into me. So they stay with the shop now, I don't own them. Uh, it's uh, become more or less a little museum. I guess because delis started to vanish. This building was photographed at one stage. A chap come in and, and told me he was doing a catalogue for filmmakers, advertisers and so on, filming iconic type locations. Hi there. Hi there. How are you going? Good, thank you. Can I please get uh, just two dollars worth of lollies? Yeah, sure. Kids used to come in and uh, I remember one coming in one day and says, oh, lollipop heaven. And I, I always thought, gee, that'd be a good little name for a shop anyway, lollipop heaven. But we still sell loose lollies. Um, we've got little dollar bags and 50 cent bags, but if a kid comes in with just five cents, you know, we can actually serve him one little lolly. I think people still go to delis. It's uh, quick and easy. It, definitely, I, I would say, uh, if there was more um, of these stores around, I think it would be uh, better in, in cases of the pandemic, for sure. You could go into a, a store, you may go in and there's no one else in the store, only the person to serve you. Um, so it's a lot less contact than going to a supermarket. There's still an importance to have uh, these stores in existence.